Jesus. Saturday, we had an early morning prayer at 6 a.m. And Sunday, we start the morning with rightly divided the word and film FM at 6 a.m. Sunday school at 9.30 and our morning worship at 11.30 a.m. Now for our upcoming events, our women's fellowship luncheon will be on Friday, November 28th, and the committee members, they are asking us, please, 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 to really support this venture. Uh, also for our women in ministry circle, we'll be at the UPCD campground on Saturday, November 29th. So all those who are involved with that, I will come and speak with you. God bless you as you keep trusting the Lord today and giving up your best. God bless you in Jesus' name. Praise God, praise God, praise God, everybody. Let's bless the Lord, everybody. Before we go any further, we just want to extend a big thank you to Sister Rhonda Dennis from the International Apostolic Ministries in Waterloo for providing us with the sponges for this weekend. Praise God. Let's put our hands together. Praise God. Remember right this time, we're going to stand. Everybody, please stand. Praise God. Praise God. But we're going to ask the host, pastor, and shepherd of this flock, Pastor Fisher, just to come and greet us in Jesus' name. Are you happy to be here today? Yeah. If you're happy, you know it, say amen. Yeah. If you're even happier, say amen. Yeah. Are you feeling good? Yeah. Are you really, really feeling good? Yeah. Praise the Lord. I'm glad to be here this morning. And certainly, God has been good to every one of us. This has become my favorite saying. It'll be better to me than I've been to myself. Because that's been at my experience every day. The things that Jesus do for me, I just can't help but praise him and give him thanks. Praise the Lord. It's a great blessing and privilege in your life and in the house of the Lord this morning. And I'm very grateful to see everyone who gathered in this house today to lift up the name of Jesus. I hope that everyone's desire and intention of the day is to magnify Jesus. Because he is the reason for it. He's our hope of survival. Without him, we are empty. Without him, we are nothing. A life without him is not worth living any at all. Praise God. He is our only reason for living. Praise God. I greet everyone. Greeting all the ministers present, Reynolds, and every other minister, all the beloved saints of God, and visitors. We're very happy to have you. Special greetings and welcome to all the members of UCAM, our national coordinator, Brother Javon Weekly, assistant coordinator, Brothers Spence, Sharoy Sh Spence, and Sister Russia Vincent. <laughs> we have become good friends with Sister Vincent and I. Praise God. Also, the second, the 12 year old Sister Kerry. <laughs> Treasurer and Sister Michelle Century. When I first met Sister Karen, I said, she was 12 year old, because she looks like 12 year old. I couldn't believe that she has actually graduated from university already. But God is good. Praise God. But we are very happy to have every member of UCAM in worship with us today. And I know that UCAM is a very important ministry. Very, very, we cannot underestimate the importance of UCAM. It is a very important ministry on the campuses because when you're on the campuses, there are so many different forces that you have to contend with. It's good to have an apostolic body that you can go to and be refreshed. Thank you for the So I give God thanks for this ministry. And I'm grateful that for those who keep carrying it on year after year. Because for my because I was a part of this ministry back in the days, over 20 years ago. But to God, it's good to see it being carried on. And I thank God for those faithful men and women who takes the time out of their busy study schedule to be a part of this ministry. The Lord is going to bless you. Keep the fire burning in your camp. Don't let the torch go out at any time because you'll have a legacy to pass on to those who are coming behind you. And we want to get it the real way. We're not going to cut it or trim it. 
Why do you come us burn in fire every time we get together to give us extra strength from the presence of the Lord? Amen? Amen. Praise the Lord. And what a time we have been having thus far this week, this weekend. What a time we have been having. Praise God. Yesterday it was a blessing being in the sanctuary to listen to the presentations. I was richly blessed. And last night, what a time. And I know the same God that showed up at the street service last night is here. And he's the same yesterday, today, and forever. What he did last night, he can do again today. Do I have a witness? Somebody believe with me. Hallelujah. Is there anybody expecting something on the floor? Jesus. Hallelujah! Praise God, praise God. 
Is that Jay Gardner here? The Lord baptized when the Holy Ghost last night in the sea service. It's Casey Smith here. She too was sick with the Holy Ghost. So praise the Lord, we will be doing baptism for those who are in baptism today. And we trust that before the days of more we receive baptism in the name of the Lord Jesus. Praise the Lord, somebody. Praise the Lord. Praise God. There's an Anne-Marie here that was at the Swiss Service last time.
Jesus. So we just gotta charge this atmosphere even right now with our worship in the name of Jesus. We're not gonna sing this song. Hallelujah to God Almighty. We're not gonna sing this song. Bless the name of Jesus. We're not gonna charge this atmosphere with worship. Hallelujah to God Almighty. Some of us still have our hope to see our very clear. Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost, hallelujah. Glory to God Almighty. 